Did you ever go on a boat ride or rafting in which the instructor said, you can take off your life jackets, no need of life jackets. That would be crazy because what does it cost? What does it cost to wear a life jacket? Safety. And how many people place their safety in earthly solutions? Let us meditate together on today's gospel to see where the real solution is. Dear brothers and sisters, Salve Maria! Today, this Thursday of the second week of Lent, we have in the first reading of the book of Jeremiah, he said something which is very strong, which is very powerful. Cursed is the man who trusts in human beings. Of course, on the contrary, blessed is the man, blessed is the person who places his trust in God. And that's what we see in today's wow. Gospel, the Gospel of St. Luke, chapter 16 and 19 to 31. It's that whole situation in which our Lord Jesus Christ puts before us a parable, a rich man who every day promoted would offer banquets, dressing and in sumptuous situations. And of course, there was a poor person, Lazarus, who asked for food and was not even, was not even quenched with the crumbs that would fall off the, off the man's, the, the rich man's tables, the scraps, not even the scraps were given to him. One day, both of them died. They appeared before the judgment and Lazarus in the heavenly bliss, in the reward, and we have the rich man whose name is not even registered in today's gospel. What does he do? He says, listen, come with your finger, quench my thirst, touch with a little bit of water because I'm suffering in these, these terrible torments, the fire. No, that's not possible. No one from above, no one from heaven can go down to the torments of hell to alleviate. Purgatory? Maybe. Hell, there's an abyss. There's an, a separation. In our lives, we have to understand that there's a time in which we're cut off. Did you ever go, for instance, to a visit, an appointment, and the doors were already closed? Or someone goes to, maybe it's a recreation or to an event, and they've arrived late. Did you ever arrived to a meeting in which the doors were closed and you were left out and you maybe you even lost your money. But imagining losing eternity. That's why we have to put our confidence in God and that's why it's necessary that we place all of our efforts to gain the reward. Afterwards, it's going to be too late. In this Lent, let's make a resolution a strong decision in order to change something in our lives, to put goals, to put deadlines on ourselves, especially regarding prayer, confession, and our religious obligations. But I'm going to give you all a special blessing through the intercession of the Blessed Virgin Mary so that those goals may be very clear and that your holy guardian angels will help you with new steps ahead in your spiritual life. And may the blessing of Almighty God, the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit come upon you and remain with you forever. Salve Maria. And please don't forget to share, like, and comment. If you like this video, press the like button and leave a comment below. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel and activate the notification bell so you won't miss any of our videos.